Hi guys! Um, I'm super excited to learn about woodwind instruments with you this week. It's crazy to think that we only have one more week of school after this. So, um, the first instrument we're going to learn about today is the flute. So it's made out of metal and it's held out to the side like this and there's a tiny little hole in it and you blow across the hole. So you don't blow into the hole, you blow across the hole. and um, then press down your fingers to make different notes. So that's um, a little bit about the flute. And then um, the second instrument is the recorder. Um, if you're in fourth grade, you've already played the recorder this year. If you're in third grade, you'll get to play next year. If you're younger than that, then you'll get to play when you're in fourth grade. And if you're in fifth or sixth grade, you probably have already played them before. So the recorder is made out of plastic, or sometimes it's made out of wood, but mostly out of plastic, and it has a bunch of holes here, and it's held in front of you, and you blow into the hole, and then cover the different holes to make um, different notes. So that's the second instrument. The third instrument we're going to learn about is the clarinet. So the clarinet is another instrument that you hold this way, and it's made out of metal and wood, and um, there is a little slit at the top of the instrument and a piece of wood that goes behind it. And you use your tongue and your breath to blow into the instrument and then you cover the different holes in order to make different notes. Um, that was the third instrument. The fourth instrument we're going to talk about is the... Um, saxophone. So the saxophone is also held this way and it's made out of metal and a little bit of wood and a little bit of plastic. So it curves out though. It has like a little almost like elephant trunk kind of thing that comes out and all the sound comes out that way. It's a little bit bigger than the other instruments and it's played a very similar way to the clarinet. So you put use your tongue and your breath to blow into the instrument with a little piece of wood behind the um, little slit and then you cover the, um, well, you pr pr press the buttons, which cover holes, to um, make different notes. So that's the fourth instrument, the saxophone. And the fifth instrument is called the bassoon. So the bassoon is a little bit trickier to play than any of the other instruments. And you play it sitting on the edge of your seat. You tuck this long strap under your booty, and then you have um, a little tiny little piece of wood that you blow into, and then you cover the holes. It's a really long instrument, which is why you need to have that strap that you sit on so that it doesn't move away from you and so that it's balanced right. So it's made out of wood and metal, and it's a really pretty instrument, but it's really hard to play because the wood that you have to blow into is so tiny and it's curved to make the exact right shape so that when you blow into it, it sounds right. So, um, those are the five instruments, the five woodwind instruments that we learned about. There are a few more, but we're not going to learn about them um, this week. So, um, let's think about some of the differences. Are they made out of the, are all of the instruments made out of the same materials or are some of them made out of different materials? And then are they all played the same way? Do they all um, get held the same way? Do they all, like do you blow into the same thing in order to make the noise or are they a little bit different? Um, those are the things that I really want you to think about this week. And then also, which instrument would you want to play if you had the chance to play any of these instruments? So um, take some time and think about that this week. And then um, I can't wait to see your responses in my email or in my um, text. I will see you guys next week.